Welcome to the Last Corner YouTube channel. As we see here, this is going to be uh, hugely important. Making sure that you look after and have your helmet. But then the lights will come on on the top right hand of your screen. And then we will go racing for the second time here in Thailand. And it's a great start from pole position once again from Ojiwara on the number 16. Takira got a sluggish start on the front row. Hafai dives at the inside of the number nine into third place. Matani, a decent start for the middle of the front row. He slots into a nice early ether on the number 17. Semi machine, sorry, takes a look behind him. Doesn't see too much because these top five riders are turning clear. Ramadipa's trying to go with them. Takira, as I say, isn't doing what he needs to do at this moment in time, just streaking clear and he's losing time as well. So Takira then, as I said, the front in the dry this year. They've been hovering in the inside and around the top 10, but this is new territory. It's the number 12 of Henry, shadows of Moop, the inside of his compatriot, and he's down, unfortunately, the final corner. Ricky Henry just pushing a little bit too much there. Into to go then here at the Chang International Circuit. And as things stand, as the 19 goes down, the Malaysian of Farish, Hafai, great shame for him. He's gone down. And is it the rear that's going to let go here as we go left and right? No, luckily, just as we uh, took it through to nine. As you see Ricky Henry making his way through on Dave, the Indian further back, which results in a big, big piercing eyes of the riders through the clear visors down into turn 12. Concentration at an all-time high. Get it nailed to the apex, avoid the slippery white lines. He looked in the Togan fight and narrowly missed out on more than one occasion. And now with two and a half laps remaining, he's going to have to fight right to the end because Zen Matani has managed to close in and is glued to the rear wheel of the tie rider. Matani's been breaking hearts all year long with his superb performance in point one. This is going to be the replay then of Zen Matani coming through turn eight. Didn't touch the white paint just when he was applying the throttle there. But we have a race on at the front. It's another half a second in the Archie Smith. He's able to take out of Ojiwara at the front. 1.2 seconds. The Japanese riders advantage. Well, then he would have done if things would have changed. But here is the number two then. One lap to go. And then he's up the front. And as you point out, Jack, it's under a second. Starting the last lap. We're going to get confirmation of that as they cross the line. Ojiwara and Schmidt. Here we go then. Last lap time here in Thailand. What is the lead at the front? Ojiwara sets the personal best lap. But even if the rear wheel falls out halfway around, Takahira not in a good enough position to be able to take enough points away. This is it. Zen Matane, one lap away from being crowned champion, but our eyes are on the front as we go through the first split. Yeah, he certainly is. Ojiwara then rounds the final corner and wins here in Thailand. A second win of the season. Congratulations, Ojiwara. And Schmidt crosses a line. Uh, Singapore also the home hero. But it is all about Zen Matani in 2024. He is the 2024 Idemitsu Asia Talent Cup champion. A dream is realized. Japan, you have a new rising star.